Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm gonna go over how to take better screenshots on Linux with FlameShot. So to start off, you need to install the FlameShot application. So open up a terminal, however you choose to do so, and uh, install FlameShot. Now, I'm doing this on Debian, but there are a bunch of different installation instructions for every Linux distribution out there. So just uh, check the article in the description for more information. But uh, let's just do sudo apt install flameshot. I'm going to let it download all the packages that it needs. And then we can close the terminal because we no longer need it. So from here, you can open up flameshot. Just go to graphics. And you're going to see a start icon. Shouldn't say start icon. You can see a system tray icon. I get those confused sometimes. And the tray. Now, this is your best friend. Now, it looks kind of weird because I'm using Mate. I think I can make it look a little bit better by just making the panel bigger or maybe smaller. <laughs> but uh, either way, when, whenever you want to take a screenshot, you can click this button here and it will bring up a dialogue. You can then draw a square of whatever you want to take a picture of. So if you want to take a picture of your desktop, you can do so like I did. You can then draw shapes if you want to draw like a, a shape around this folder here. You can draw arrows anywhere you want to draw them. You can uh, highlight things with your highlighter. There's actually like a color chooser. So if you hold the, the right mouse button down, you can have different things here. There's also like drawing. So if you want to draw on your screenshots, you can upload it to the internet instantly by clicking the upload imager button, open it in an app. You can write text over it. <laughs> like so and I've been using this tool a lot lately uh, just for the website just uh, you know in my blog post because honestly it makes things so much easier because if I uh, let me close this horrible screenshot here because for example if I'm writing a tutorial and it just makes things so much easier and I want you to open up the desktop folder you know I can draw my screenshot like so and I can click the arrow button and I can put an arrow you know in and whatever color I want pointing to what I'm saying. And if you use a lot of screenshots and you take a lot of screenshots on Linux like I do, something that I highly, highly, highly recommend, you know, there's a lot of different features and I really just love this app. So anyways, guys, this is how to take better screenshots in Linux. If you are interested in FlameShot, which I highly recommend, I would actually look into the manual for this program and see if you can swap out the print screen button because I've done that and it's really nice. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.